Welcome to Roman Catholic Plus Bible Readers Club. I am Pastor Luis Walter D. Castillo and I will read to you in the Bible how to choose a leader, especially in our lectures next year in May 2022. The presidency and other leaders. So, in my opinion, um, he or she has to be a strong leader and who can uh, delegate duties of his, uh, his or her um, subordinates and staff. platform is to uh, minimize or if not uh, totally uh, eradicate illegal drugs in our country. Uh, we cannot be the courier or drop off or import or manufacture of illegal drugs. Um, illegal gambling can be uh, allowed like a uh, wetting and uh, um, unofficial cup fighting like Tupada um, because uh, it, it doesn't destroy individuals unlike drugs it destroy individuals, families, communities and eventually countries so the president should also um, talk and talk to the Senate about uh, businesses and or economy, about uh, how to um, compromise businesses, big businesses with um, medium and uh, small businesses so they can uh, they can live. Um, coexistence, um, not uh, small and medium businesses devoid by big companies. Um, so there should be also be exemptions for other street vendors. So our aim is to be a first world country and an illegal drug street country um, because uh, illegal drugs leads to more serious crimes so what does the Bible say about electing a leader that is free Timothy chapter 3 verse 16 This is a faithful saying If a man desires the position of a bishop or a leader he desires a good work A bishop then must be blameless the husband of one wife temperate sober minded of good behavior hospitable, able to teach, not given to wine, not violent, not greedy for money, but gentle, not quarrelsome, not covetous, one who rules his own house well, having his children in submission with all reverence. For if a man does not know how to rule his own house, how will he take care of the church of God? Not a novice, lest being puffed up with pride, he fall into the sun. The sin, condemnation is the devil. Moreover, he must have a good testimony among those who are 
outside, lest it be for the old coach and the snare of the devil. He or she shall not be a novice, because a novice can be influenced by his or her advisors that can lead to mistakes. Um, moreover, he or she should have the experience to handle the opposition. Let us read this in the Tagalog Bible. Um, Biblia. sino man ay pagsisikat na maging obispo o isang lider ay mabuting gawa ang inananasa. Dapat na, na na ang obispo ay walang kakaibasa. Asawa na isa lamang babae, mapagpigil, mahinapon, mapag-isip, mahinapon ng pag-iisip, mahusay, mapagpagpuloy, sapat na makapagturo, hindi magulo, hindi palaway, hindi malumanay, hindi makipagtalo, hindi maibigin sa salapi, na mamahalang mabuti ng kanyang hindi sa pinahayan, na sinusipin ng kanyang mga anak na may buong kausayan. Ngunit kung ang sino man na ay hindi marunong mamahalang, sa kanyang sariling sambahayan, paano na kung mamahala sa Iglesia ng Diyos o sa bayan? Hindi panuhan. Baka siya kung mapagpalalo ay mahulog sa kapakusahan ng damda. Bukod dito, dapat din siya ay magkaroon ng mabuting pagkakupo. sa labas para mamahulit sa ating tasan at silo ng jambo. So, hindi siya baguhan na, na hindi na pwede influensyahan ng kanyang sariling um, uh, kabinete at ng posisyon kaya na pandamit sa ating ngayon. So, yun ang sinasabi ng Biblia. So, um, paano naman yung what about the what the Bible said that uh, um, he or she can on the uh, rank for president, not, uh, does that mean women cannot run like uh, Lenny Rebrand? Because he, she has also had the qualifications. So, what does the Bible say about this? Is that a contradiction? I will read it. So it says here in um, Matthew chapter 5 verse 3 or verse 48, therefore you shall be perfect just as your father in heaven is perfect. In Tagalog, Kayo nga ay magpaka, mga pakasakdal 
na gaya ng inyong ama sa kalangitan na saklat. So, the love of Jesus is uh, meant to be changed if, uh, because uh, if we are amended if uh, the law says it. If um, the times need it, it is possible for me to leave the country. Uh, in fact, uh, to two women have uh, led our country, um, President Cory Aquino and uh, President Gloria Macapagal Arroyo. Just wisely in the upcoming elections.